the rig rat hey welcome to another edition of the rig rat where i am unboxing a sound module from t-h-o-m-a-n-n -N music um gee i think they're in great britain but then again i guess the sound module comes from austria so anyway um this is the unboxing of the v3 sound accordion xxl it's a little sound module that i've been wanting for a long time and i wanted it back when i had a numa compact 2 and the piano was just not great enough i couldn't hold my head high um and I don't, I, I don't have one, but if this sounds great, I'm going to get one because this includes piano. And, uh, but the main reason I'm getting it now is for the accordion sounds. That's why I chose this one instead of the Grand Piano XXL. Uh, I chose this one because I have an Akai MP. K225, which I'm going to use just for left-hand bass, but I'm going to do accordion bass. How about that? Isn't that so interesting to you? Maybe not, but as you know, all unboxing videos, you can't redo it. Once you do it, you can't redo it as you begin to start. I can't, I'm not going to retape all this stuff, but here we go. We're going to open this. This is what the box looks like, huh? Okay, and then you got this there and uh, I got all kinds of shadows hey let me throw a light on see look there's another light maybe that's how okay you got that is for all you unboxing fanatics you gotta get the full um, experience uh, let's see I'll take my exacto knife cut along here this side, cut along there, and then I'm going to rip this off so I can access this, cutting along, oh, I'm excited, I hope it's going to be great, and my, my feelings are that if it's so great, I'll get a second one because I feel I should have a backup, why do I feel that way? And I really don't have the money. <laughs> I, I keep unboxing equipment, but a lot of the equipment I take back because I'm not that happy with. But uh, let's see. Here's some wonderful paper. Maybe it's full of uh, the virus, the COVID virus. Okay, we're removing the paper. And uh, removing the paper. Hey, it comes with a MIDI cord. Wow, I didn't expect that. Why would I have that? I got MIDI cords, but that's nice to have. Well, that's awful nice. And look, they give you some sort of comic. Well, that's weird. Huh, anyway, uh, that's nice. And that's that. Here's the box. Here's this box. I'm gonna remove that box. Gently toss it over to the side. And let's get an even better look, shall we? Sure. Oh, so professional. So professional. Here we go. Okay, so in this instance, I am, I don't know if it's their practice to do this, but they give you a MIDI cable. Hmm. Maybe I'll just leave it attached. But there it is. Ooh, that's, that's, oh, look at the design. What are they somebody really went all out with the design of that <gasps> there it is it says right there accordion xxl looks like i'm gonna have to use mr exacto knife and cut into here oh yep this was that was the tape holding it all together oh boy now if you've seen other videos on the V3 sound module, hmm, you'll notice 
that it comes with a big book. Boy, I see, I believe when I have the, when I have, <laughs> and that's another keyboard that I purchased and then got rid of, and now I had to purchase it again. Used this time around the Akai MPK 225. And hopefully I'm, that, that baby should be able to do all kinds of mapping as far as uh, accessing all the necessary banks you got to go uh, through to get to all the wonderful sounds. Am I going to talk to you about how many sounds? No. Am I, I, I'm, am I going to show you what it sounds like? No. There's other uh, uh, demos and stuff like that. Oh, it gives you a little uh, recommendation as to where to put the Velcro. <laughs> but they love, they, they really care about the customer, apparently. Well, that's nice, this foam. Yeah, that's pretty cool. They realize that it's nice to have a square shape. Yeah, I wish this was made into a square. Why? Why do I care about that? But anyway, I wish it was. <gasps> oh, my God. Uh-oh. It's got the European end. Hmm. Let's hope that this thing over here is the United States compatible. I don't know. Uh-oh. This could be a problem. Wait a minute. No. What is that? Oh, little feet. These are feet you can stick on the bottom. That's nice. Here's that Velcro. That's nice. But I'm not sure I understand. So if you don't own the other kind, because the other kind is a standard, I've got them laying around. It's like a standard, you know, a boom box type uh, cord. And uh, yikes, that scared me for a moment but everything will work just fine. <laughs> everything will work just fine, I'm sure. All right, and here it is. It comes in a Ziploc bag, in case you want to put it back and send it back and say, I hate it. No, no, no. They're putting it in a Ziploc bag because they got class. They could have put something cheap, but this is wonderful. Does it smell like COVID? No. Boy, that's nice. This is neat. This raised logo. Um, that's nice. And what's cool is they do label all these things on the back. So you've seen other videos, right? Uh, uh, of the different of the things on the back. This pushes in for some reason. I mean, if you're gonna choose power or probably powered by a laptop, I, I don't know. I don't, don't ask me, I don't know. But one of these is reverb, I'm gonna assume that's that, and then one of these is volume. And uh, that's that. What's, what else is, can I say? There's the bottom. It has feet. Two feet here. Nah, yeah, a little bit here. These two feet are not like that foot. It's not as tall. Don't ask me why. But I, 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 I'm so, I can't wait to get into this and see if I can at least access all the programs using the Akai MPK-225. And I can do a left-hand bass like Rayman Zarek. And I'm going to drop the name Paul Warren as jammed in a classic rock band with me. And he, Paul Warren, has played with um, Rod Stewart for like 13 years. He was his live guitar player. And Paul Warren has done so many other great things. He's just a crazy gifted guitar player. And uh, this is beautiful. Feels good. It is so lightweight. I don't know what else to say. I'm going to try to keep it short this time. Thank you for watching. Bye.